Hey guys, what's up? It is April 3rd, 2010, the day before Easter. Happy Easter. I wanted to talk about a couple of things that are going on right now that all of you can get involved with and some stuff that's coming up that some of you can get involved with as well. First of all, let's talk about the American DJ Dream Wedding Gig Video Contest. It's going on right now. If you go to my main YouTube channel, the featured video is of the American DJ Dream Wedding Gig Video Contest. The way this works is you submit a video talking about your dream wedding gig. So you're a DJ or you want to be a DJ. You're going to do a gig. Where's it going to be? Who's it going to be for? What kind of music are you going to play? Who are going to be the guests? And how are you going to use some of the lights that are offered as prizes in the contest to help create your dream wedding gig? We've got 45 entries right now and we're halfway through the contest. We have to get all of the entries in by April 30th, 2010 and then we're going to take several days, I forget what it is, a week or two or something, to go not only through those videos and pick favorites and, and evaluate who qualifies, who doesn't, all that kind of fun stuff, but we're also going to give everyone an opportunity to vote for the viewer's choice video. What that is would be you, the viewer, your favorite video. You can go in the comment section and say, I vote for DJ, uh, DJ Disco King or whoever your favorite is and the person who collects the most votes I believe wins a set of Revo Raves which are really cool new lights. I don't even have one yet. But the thing about this contest is I made a, an arrangement with American DJ where whenever we get 100 videos submitted, 100 entries, they have to add an additional light to the grand prize and there are so many cool lights out right now. I want to see him add as many likes as possible. We're at 45 videos right now. I would love to see, well, we have to see 100. I mean, there's just no question about it. I would love to see 200. I'd love to make them add two more prizes to the grand prize. Right now, we got a Galaxian Royale that's not even out yet. It is a prize. You're going to be able to win it before you can buy it. And there are so many new lights coming down the pipeline. Who knows what you might get before you can buy it. It's really up to American DJ what they add, but they're definitely going to want to promote their new products. So I'm thinking we're pretty safe in assuming that as many videos as we can get, we're going to get some cool stuff in the grand prize. So keep entering, enter as often as you'd like. It's a worldwide contest. You can submit 100 videos if you want to. I don't care. You're totally allowed to do that. You can have anybody you want vote for you. You can have your church, your whole school, whatever, come in and vote for you vote for you as their favorite in the comment section and you could win two Revo Raves. We've got a lot of people who have done multiple videos. We've got a lot of people who have promised they're going to do videos and haven't, like Simon from the DJ business. Get on that dude. You said you were going to do videos. You haven't done them. Do them. And some of my other buddies out there, kind of my core group of guys that I see when I travel, I haven't seen videos from these guys. So get your videos up. So that's enough about that. Get on that. The other thing I want to talk about is the YouTube DJ's Live that's going on in Racine, Wisconsin at Buckets Pub. Our good friend DJ Big Ron has organized this and hosted it. He did it last year. He's doing it again this year. I think the head count so far is like 30, 35 DJs are going to be showing up. It's kind of like the original Practice and Enjoy where you come in and you play with some DJ gear that some of the other people brought and there will be some, I guess, seminars or keynote speakers that are going to show up to give you some good information on not only equipment but business. we got people coming in from all over the country from what I understand. Might even be somebody from Europe, I don't know. But who knows who can show up at this. It should be a cool event. It's happening in Racine, Wisconsin at Buckets Pub. If you go to DJ Big Ron's YouTube channel or alternately the YouTube DJ's live webpage, you can get more information on that. There's also one coming up on the West Coast in June. We'll talk about that another day probably going to go to that one. So yeah, I'm going to get more involved with YouTube DJs Live this year, it, meaning that I'm, I'm actually organizing a party for the 21 and older guys at Naughty Pine Bar and Grill in Racine, Wisconsin, or uh, I'm sorry, in Lake Geneva, Wisconsin. It's actually in the unincorporated village of Springfield, but I think it has a Lake Geneva address. Essentially, it's between Burlington and Lake Geneva and East Troy is close by and if you live out that way in Walworth County and you're looking for an excuse not to go into the big city and you still want to get involved that's your opportunity because I know some of you were scared to get out of Walworth County I noticed that about Walworth people you don't leave your county much anyway it's a fun county it's a strange county you've got a lot of rednecks out there and then you've got one of the richest uh, most exclusive areas in the entire state there too so it's a really bizarre mix but Naughty Pine is really good food. We went there last year. For those of you who went to Evolve and saw me 
last year who came to YouTube DJ's Live. We all went to the Naughty Pine afterwards and had pizza and it was delicious. They got good hamburgers too. And actually, uh, I forgot all about this, but I brought Jonathan in there right when it opened, whenever he was here. I think it was like two years ago. And my friend Dan and I, who owns this bar, got him very drunk. That was funny. We got video on it. You can go back and watch that. Now, it's 21 and up. I got to stress this. I've had a few people send me messages, ask me, hey, Brian, you think you can sneak me in? No, I can't for a couple different reasons. Number one, this is my friend's bar, and I got to respect his liquor license. If I vouch for somebody, and they come in, and they're not 21, and local law enforcement, who does hang out there, spots this, my friend could lose his liquor license, and yeah, I can't have that. It's not worth the risk. So it's no offense to you under 21 guys. None, none at all, and, and I'm sorry if you're taking it the wrong way, but no, it's 21 and up. And the reason I organized this party the way I did it, honestly, I mean, because I don't lie to you guys, I wanted the older guys to have a little time to themselves. A lot of you younger guys out there are doing a fantastic job at what you're doing, and you're listening, and you're learning, as you should. But some of you under 21 guys talk a lot. You talk more than you should listen. You think you know shit that you don't know. And I'm not singling anybody out. It's just kind of how it is. If an adult does that and they're over 21, we could just write them off as kind of a douche and, and leave it at that. But, yeah, you know, there's a time for the kids and there's a time for the big people. And this particular event that I've put together is definitely for the big people. And there's going to be plenty of time for you under 21 guys to hang out at Buckets in the back room in Racine. So only for the big people. Please don't even ask me to sneak in if you're under 21. I can't do it. I won't do it. I've got way too much respect for my guy. He's been cool enough to give us this facility. So now, you 21 and up guys who are coming to YouTube DJ's Live, how are you going to get the buckets? Or how are you going to get to uh, uh, Naughty Pine? Everybody's worried that it's a three-hour drive. It's totally not. It's like 40, 45 minutes. And if you're a mobile DJ, you should be used to traveling anyway. Big Ron said the other night, well, some people aren't going to come. Well, I don't know why. I think they're afraid to drive out into the country, uh, you know, afraid that the, the, the boys from Deliverance with the banjos are going to get them or something. Well, this could definitely happen. But, no, honestly, I'm actually going to go to Racine before I go to Naughty Pine. I'm going to go to wherever you guys are staying, whether it be the hotel that you're staying at or uh, whether it be Buckets. I've got a Chevy Suburban. I can seat seven. So it's myself and six passengers. So I'd be more than happy to drive 60 there. That's my plan. I'm going to drive down to Racine first and then over to the Naughty Pine. So I'm going to shuttle some of you. Jason Rush had mentioned that he has, I think he's got a Tahoe. I think he can shuttle some people as well. So you don't necessarily even have to drive. And even better, you can booze up a little more. I I'm obviously can't drink because I'm going to be driving. So I can only have a few early in the evening and then i got to knock it off. But some of you who, who are going to get shuttled by myself or Jason or maybe Big Ron, who's got a minivan, perfect. So you don't even have to drive out there. If you're, you're a guest in our town, we'll drive you. So, hey, that's pretty cool. We've got plenty of guys with big vehicles that can make that happen. But, yeah, we're going to have DJ stuff there. We're going to have the Pioneer CDJ, uh, not CDJ, I'm sorry, the Pioneer DJ M5000 Mixer. I'm going to bring that in. That's brand new. A lot of you wanted to see that going to bring Virtual DJ in with it, the MEP 7000 from Pioneer. I'm also going to bring in the Radius 3000 decks from American DJ and the uh, new mixer, the 1400 DSP. It's the MX 1400 DSP. A lot of you haven't seen this one yet. I haven't done any video on it yet, but I think you'll like it. It's almost like the uh, DNX 1500 here by Denon. It's got the matrix switches on it. It has some effects, but it's a budget version of it and it might be something that some of you can look at who like the idea of a den on. This could be a nice alternative at a budget price. And it's solid. You'll, you'll dig it. So I'm bringing that. And then our friend Rich Martinez said that he wanted to bring in his den on rig. He has a set of 1200s and then the X120 mixer. He's got in a case. He wanted to show that off. So I'd love to see that. I'm sure you would too. We're going to have computers there for you virtual DJ guys. And we're also going to try to incorporate video into this with, and Dan's got some big screens there. We could probably run uh, either SVGA or um, HDMI into them. Alternately, maybe we'll have a big screen set up. Not sure how we're going to work it out, but video will be involved as well at any rate. So, anyhow, be there 
for that. If you're over 21, you're in the area, bring your friends, please. I think I'm going to bring uh, or ask the girls from Grand Geneva from Evolve to come and, and hang out. They're like my little nieces. I, I make them call me Uncle Brian. And part of the reason I make them call me Uncle Brian is because they're really attractive young women and I want to keep our relationship nice and platonic because they're very attractive young women. So with that in mind, come on down, boys. It should be fun. And hopefully they'll bring friends and we'll all hang out. We'll have dancers. We'll have an audience to play for. Uh, open decks to anyone who comes and is the DJ. Come in and have fun. We'll have lights. I'm going to bring the Vizzy LED spots in. Should be cool. So there's my vlog, and I hope to see you guys next week for YouTube DJs Live. We'll talk about the other YouTube DJs Live events coming up on the West Coast after this one. So that's it. Sorry I was long winded. That's what's going on. I have more tutorials coming up hopefully later on today or tomorrow. Practice and enjoy.